Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Another example about construct how to construct a root locus to find the range of k that will uh, make the system stable, unstable, or marginally stable. So construct the root locus for the PI control system. It is a PI control system because we have a PI controller because we have k and we have 2k over s so this is the the p controller and this is the i controller so it's a pi controller uh, now this is the plant and this is the feedback transfer function To construct the road locus for this particular system, we have to find the poles and zeros for the open load transfer function. So the open load transfer function is the forward transfer function multiplied by the feedback transfer function, which is k. 1 plus 2 over s multiplied by the plant transfer function 1 over s, s, s uh, plus 3 whole square plus 16 multiplied by the 1 over s plus 5 which is the which of s. I will write this one in simpler form is multiply the denominator and denominator by s it's ks plus 2 over s multiply by 1 multiplied by 1 it's the, the same the denominator is I want to open this system it's s square plus 6s plus 9 plus 16 it's 25 multiplied by s plus 5 and then the poles of this system are the ends we have how many poles one here we have two poles and here we have one pole so we have four poles we have s equal to zero and s equal to minus five and s square plus six s plus twenty five equal to zero. How to find the the root the roots of this uh, system? We use the quadratic equation S12 equal to minus P plus or minus root of B square minus four A C over two A and this tends to be minus Six plus or minus square root of thirty six minus four into twenty five is hundred over two and this equals to minus six plus or minus root of minus one multiplied by root of sixty four over 2 is equal to minus 3 because minus 6 over 2 is minus 3 plus or minus root of 64 is 8 and root of minus 1 is j <coughs> so it's a complex number plus or minus j 8 over 2 is 4 so we have s 
let's say this is S1, this is S2, S3 is equal to minus 3, it will be <coughs> plus 3, oh no, it's uh, minus 3, plus J4, and this 4 is equal to minus 3, minus J4. So we have four poles, it's one, two, and three, and four. All these numbers will make the, the denominator equal to zero. What about the zero that will make the numerator is zero? Zeros, which is m equal to one. It's s equal to minus 2 I think yes it's equal to minus 2 we finished step number 1 step number 2 in road locus construction we find the number of road locus or road lotion we will, we will draw the diagram This is the x-axis. And this is the y-axis. Let us assume the following. Here it's 2, 4, 6, and 8. minus 2, minus 4, minus 6, and minus 8, 2, 4, 6, and 8, here is also minus 2, minus 4, minus 6, and minus 8, Here we have the imaginary axis, J omega, and here we have the real axis. Now, let's identify the poles and zeros on the S plane. This is an S plane. And we will use another color. For the poles, we have... 0 and minus 5 0 in the origin and minus 5 here and the other thing is minus 3 plus j4 minus 3 is here plus j4 and minus 3 minus j4 so we have the poles identified on the s plane now let's go for the zero we have a zero on minus two is identified by a circle here is the zero now let's uh, see the number of both doshi from zero To minus 2 we have root locus, so that's then from minus 2, let's write it here, from 0 to minus 2, it's in root. Now from uh, minus 2 up to minus 5 on the real axis, it's out of the it's out of the effect. From minus five to minus infinity, it's in both pockets. So we want to highlight it. What is in the row focus in the real axis? This one, and also this one. 
the third step third point is to find the breakaway point how to find the breakaway point as we solved in the previous examples that the open loop transfer function as a magnitude is equal to 1 then k multiplied by s plus 2 over s by s squared plus 6s plus 25 multiplied by s plus 5 is equal to 1. Now k is equal to s multiplied by s squared plus 6s which is 25 divided by s plus 5 over s plus 2. After that after rearranging the equation in terms of k, we find the derivative of k to find the derivative it's al maqam li mushtaqqat al basit let's for example simplify this one it's S cube plus six s square plus twenty five s multiplied by s plus five over s plus two and this will equal to s to the power four plus six s to the power three plus 25s to squared plus 5s to the power of our 3 plus 30s squared plus 125s over s plus 2 also this one will equal to plus 11s cubed plus 25 plus 30 is 55 s squared mm -hmm. plus 125 s over s plus 2. Now we will use this one to drive. Take the derivative of this. That represents the k with respect to s, and it will equal to the maqam to the mushtaq at the bus 4s to the power 3 plus 33 s squared plus 110 s plus 125. Minus minus s to the power 4 plus 11s cubed plus 55 s squared plus 125 multiplied by s over s plus 2 and the answer is Four s to the power four plus thirty three s to the power three is one ten s square plus one twenty five s plus eight s to the power three plus sixty six s square plus 220s plus 250 minus the same thing here 
all over this plus two. So it's only an algebraic equation. So the the power four is the highest order here. It remains the same. Plus thirty-three s cube plus eight s cube. So it's forty-one. Forty-one. Here it would be three s to the power four because we already have a minus s cube s to the power four. So it remains 3s to the power 4. Now 33s to the power 3 plus 8, it's 41. 41 minus 11, it's 30s cubed. Plus, here we have 110 plus 66 is 160, 76. 176 minus 55. This will equal to 1 to 1, 121 s square plus for s plus 1, it's 125 plus 220. 335 345 345 minus 125 it's 220 so it's 220s plus For the constant, it remains the same. 250 over s plus 2. And now we will equal this equation to 0. And this will be multiplied by 0. The remaining is s to the power 3s to the power 4, that's 20s cubed, is 121 s squared, that's 220 s plus 250 equal to zero. Now to find the end, the breakaway point we should we should find the roots of this fourth order equation. So we will have four results. Three will be rejected and one will be accepted. And it depends on the position of of the root. Is it in the root locus or not? So we will solve this one in MATLAB. A G equal to three thirty one twenty one two twenty and two fifty. Now we, say we add this common roots of j, g equal to. There are four answers as we expected. All of them are complex. We had minus four plus j two point zero five and minus four minus j two point zero five. So we had zero point nine zero point nine nine seven plus one point seven six. And also minus point nine nine minus J one one point seven six. So
So according to the graph of the root locus, we have range from 0 to 2. <coughs> we have a range from 0 to minus 2 and from minus 5 to minus infinity. So it appears that these two are rejected and these two are accepted. <coughs> 